Hello everyone. Welcome to the course of fundamentals of IoT in short FIOT. In today's class, we are going to learn a new topic called Industrial Internet of Things. In short, we can call it as IIoT. Okay. So what are these uh, Industrial Internet of Things means? So the Industrial Internet of Things or IIoT is the use of smart sensors as well as actuators to enhance the manufacturing as well as industrial processes. So same, similar to an internet of things where sensors and actuators are connected over the internet. Similarly, here also, these kind of smart sensors and actuators will be connected over the uh, internet, okay, through a uh, network, okay, especially designed to enhance the manufacturing as well as the industrial processing. So these connected sensors and actuators enables company to pick up uh, inefficiencies and also uh, problems very much sooner. So this helps in saving time as well as money and also it helps in supporting business intelligence effect. Okay. So how actually this industrial IoT works means industrial IoT is a network of intelligent devices connected to form systems that monitor, collect, exchange, as well as an, uh, analyze data. So each industrial IoT ecosystem will be containing some of the points. What are these? We are going to see. So each industrial IoT ecosystem will be consisting of connected devices that can sense. That means the devices uh, integrated with the sensors. They also communicate. Okay, It may be wired or wireless over a network. And not only that, they also store information about the collected data. Okay. Next, next one is the public or a private data communication infrastructure. Okay. So whatever the sensors gather the data, that data will be stored and that uh, data will be, sometimes it can be public or sometimes it can be private. Okay. Through a particular communication, wired or wireless communication infrastructure mostly wirelessly, okay, through an internet infrastructure, okay. Next one is like uh, an analytics and applications that generate business information from the raw data. And the next one is storage for data that is generated by the industrial IoT devices as well as people. So all these things, sensing, okay, uh, making the sensing data to stored and communicating that with several infrastructure, okay? So let's see the overview of the infrastructure. Industrial IoT infrastructure will be having data processing, analytics, business application integration, and automated processing database, okay? So these are connected to the IoT platform as well as the servers. And these platform, IoT platform and the servers will be connected to the, again, IoT gateway or the edge gateway, where this IoT gateway and edge gateway are connected to our sensors, actuators, or edge nodes, anything some. So based on the data gathered by the sensors through using an IoT gateway, okay, they get into the platform, IoT platform or the server through which a particular data processing, analytics, business applications, automated process database will be happening. And again, that data will be used in order to move some actuators or do some particular specific task. So this can be considered as the industrial IoT infrastructure. Now, which industries are using IoT means industrial IoT means first one is automotive industry. So almost all the robotic industrial robots where the robots are used for uh, manufacturing the vehicles and something like that, okay? So where most of the manufacturing process is automated. So there, industrial IoT is used. Next comes the agriculture industry. So there will be lots and lots of sensors in order to collect the data, soil nutrients, moisture, okay? Uh, so lots of uh, things, sensors will be used in order to sense several parameters, okay? to help the farmers and the next industry is oil and gas industries okay so these oil and gas industries can be monitored based on several sensors if at all the oil and gas is transported from one point to another point or one place to another place you can also 
track that particular aircraft of the ship lines or the uh, pipelines of that particular oil, oil and gases. Okay, everything can be uh, secured with respect to the industrial IoT devices. Okay, now let's see some of the benefits of the industrial IoT. So, one of the top benefits of the industrial IoT used in the manufacturing in, uh, industry is that uh, it's enable predictive maintenance. Okay, so based on the sensors data, it can be easily predictive and it can be maintained so the maintenance can also be uh, very much easy okay so organizations can use real-time data generated from the industrial iot system in order to predict when the machine will be uh, needed to serviced okay so pre uh, if prior only we can estimate the machines okay when they get need to be serviced as that most of the time will be saved okay so there won't be any kind of delay between the process, okay? So another benefit is more efficient field service, okay? So field service means industrial IoT technology help field service technicians identify potential issues, okay? In customer equipment, okay? So uh, these kind of uh, industrial IoT devices, what they does is field service means whenever the particular uh, people or uh, particular employees who does service or the technicians who does service to the several equipment or the devices for this particular equipment and devices in order to find the faults in them and in order to fix the problems industrial iot devices are most used okay next comes asset tracking okay so at asset tracking is nothing but the tra tracking of the location okay or the tracking of the product based on the manufacturers and customers this can uh, comes or falls under the asset tracking okay next on the whole it is industrial iot is also allows to enhance the customer satisfaction okay see and that last industrial iot also improves facility management manufacturing equipment is uh, susceptible okay and to wear and tear okay which can be extracted by the certain conditions in a factory so it also uh, helps in monitoring the facility management and all those things now let's see what are the risks and challenges in the industrial iot so the biggest risks associated with the industrial iot is its security and the patch management patch management in the sense suppose you have once installed a particular IoT device with respect to industry, okay? The software present in this particular industrial IoT uh, should be keep on upgrading. So there will be several patches need to be installed in order to upgrade that particular software present in the industrial IoT. This is also one of the big challenge. So security can be uh, sometimes uh, into the risk and the patch management will be sometimes, okay, becomes the challenging task in order to periodic firmware updates now let's see what is the difference between iot and industrial iot so iot applications connect devices across multiple vertical okay uh, multiple verticals or multiple applications like including agriculture healthcare enterprise consumer and utilities smart cities governments okay smart homes etc etc so these iot also include appliances or smart appliances fitness bands and several more applications whereas coming to industrial iot they are not generalized they are only fixed to the manufacturing as well as the industrial company so it's a kind of uh, oil and gas utilities uh, manufacturing companies okay so there sometimes there will be a high risk of uh, uh like uh, system failures and all those things okay in order to improve the efficiency in order to improve the health and safety of these particular devices industrial iot's are specially designed for the industrial and manufacturing related company applications now let's see some of the examples okay industrial so smart communication smart cities smart car robotics industrial factory and manufacturing, smart grid, smart power utilities, all this comes under industrial IoT applications. So 
we have several uh, vendors or companies which will be providing this industrial IoT services. Okay, so let's see some of them: ABB Ability, Aveva Wonderware. Axon, Cisco IoT, Fanec Field System, Linux Global Manufacturing, Mindspeare by Siemens, okay, uh, Platin, and Predix by GE. All this will be providing industrial related IoT applications. So, if you see the future of uh, industrial IoT, so coming to the industries, the industry was started from the basic, like industry. 1.0 we call it as right now the trending is the industry 4.0 where it is the fourth industrial revolution where all the the complete industry is automated and everything it becomes smart and connected over the internet with uh, with the help of several sensors okay like monitoring the cold storages monitoring the automated process everything is automatically controlled okay so that's why this revolution is considered as the industrial 4.1 and as we are uh, into the fifth generation of the technology okay so integrating the fifth generation to the industrial iot okay we are making the industries or the manufacturing companies much more smarter 